Well, recently planted trees all ruined in a South Bay neighborhood. Just a couple of weeks ago, San Jose City leaders helped plant ne nearly 30 trees in the Calle Willow neighborhood. Now almost all of them have been destroyed. San Jose police say someone is in custody. NBC Bay Area's Jocelyn Moran is in the newsroom tonight. And Jocelyn, what do we know? Now, Gia, these trees were planted after hearing from businesses that more shade was needed along the sidewalks on Calle Willow, hoping it would bring more business to their stores. Mayor Mahan even helped plant them, but the only lasted about a week before somebody decided to damage 26 of the 29 trees. Residents in the area say they're mad and fed up with the overall crime in the area too. It was all smiles and cheers on May 9th, the day these trees were planted. Today, this is what's left of them. San Jose police say the man in this photo damaged 26 of them just one week after they were planted. Tonight, he's in police custody. Cornelio Espinosa says he saw him do it, describing him as quiet and reserved. He saw him cut one of the trees and asked him why he was doing it. He says the man didn't respond. The next day, Cornelio saw just how much damage was done. The trees now have to be repaired. Tonight, the city says changes are coming to make sure something like this doesn't happen again. Now that we, we know that there's folks who want to harm our environment, and so we are making sure that the, the trees are, are wired. The barbed wire or the chicken wire, right? So, so it, one, it allows the, tree, the trees to still grow, but uh, it prevents folks from uh, grabbing and uh, creating damage to the tree. Todo el tiempo se meten a robar. This business owner in the Calle Willow area has noticed an uptick in crime. She says her business has been robbed at least twice. The new chief of our police department. Meanwhile, San Jose City Councilman Omar Torres says crime is top of mind. We have a newly formed business association and they're holding us accountable. Jocelyn Moran, NBC Bay Area News.